Josh Green here for Seconds Hours Lights. We're joined by Billy Cash here just outside Brentwood. It's uh, you've been in this gym what, four or five months now. I feel like you're, you're settling into the new surroundings. Yeah, we're settling in. There's a bit more room, a bit more space. Too. We settled on the upstairs up here too. So it's, uh, it's, it's a pleasure to work in this gym. It's a good gym, good facilities, and uh, great trainers, great photos. So it's, uh, it's a good gym. Speaking to Connor earlier, saying the fact it's it's out of the way and there's no distractions there, it's, it's a good thing to have. Yeah, it's such out of the way. Yes, listen, it's out of the way. You never think this gym's there, would you? <laughs> listen, if you're trying to find it, you definitely wouldn't find it, would you? If you're looking at that problem this morning, yeah. I mean, it's, uh, it's, I mean on, on, it's, it's way out of the way, but listen, it's uh, so I did get your head down, get focused, and, uh, and uh, get ready for your focus. To uh, getting focused, I mean, what have we got in the, in line for yourself at the moment? Where are we looking? Well, I'm fine. The 22nd of January. Um, so I'm just getting ready. I'm just getting ready for that now. 22nd of January. Hopefully, uh, you know, we'll get we'll get we'll get a good name. Hopefully, the European the European title. Or, you know, where I'm set of Signiani or um, you know, I will have a fire. So we'll just wait wait to find out now. Should you know, next couple of weeks, I'll uh, should hear of uh, our name should be in the house or bonds. Hard work through Christmas. So. Hard work. We train all over Christmas. Are we? Are we? I've been in the gym Christmas day. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Family are gonna be happy with that. Yeah, I love it. So we're just playing it on for you, and it's uh, and then we'll be in the gym Christmas to go all over Christmas, and uh, you know, just to get ready for the Main thing is, to, you know, I, I'm box now since disabled, so main thing is, is, is you know, getting a, getting a good win in January, and uh, hopefully get world title, you know, get world title, world title shot next year. Is that the big aim for 2022, getting that world title shot? And yeah, put yourself in the I think, I think anything, anything, anything yeah. less next year is, is, is a bit of a letdown for me, so. And um, you know, definitely one billion percent. You know, world title show. Being a disciplined world title show next year. How would you reflect on your your 2020 when you say the world title? Next Listen, year? It, it, it started off fantastic. You know, you know, I had a good a good start, a good stoppage against um, um, obviously then Bendy got out there three rounds and. You know, then there were talks a lot of things, but um, other fights and other fights never happened. as meant to happen. I had a few pressure issues too. So, you know, um, we're back. We're back now. We're back, we're, we're ready to go and we're ready to get these big names out. You know, you've got Superman Jr. and Williams for a fight on the 29th of uh, January. So after I get my fight out of the way, and, you know, that's good. And you know, if there's if any other big fights, I'll get the winner. They can't get any other fights. We'll hopefully get them one of them, one of them, one of them, one of them the winner of them too. And, and um and, and, and move on from there. You talk about that because you Ben Junior against Williams, it's a, a big fight on Sky. And you, obviously, it's been knocked back a couple of months due to the injury. But do you feel you feel like you would face the winner? Of that? Yeah, definitely. This time, I I I I'd want the winner one one and two. The big, the, you know, the winner and two be, be a bit of a name. And, you know, I, I, I believe I'm, I'm the best middleweight in the country, and uh, you know, and if you know, that to have a fight, we'll, we'll get on and see see who really is the best uh, middleweight in the country. And, uh, um, I am. I believe a big, up, uh, one big percent big, big, big both. Do you feel like Chris Eubank Jr. in that fight is taking Liam Williams a little bit lightly because he, he looks at him and sees him as more of a scrapper? Listen, than I don't. Boxing. I listen. I don't think he's taking him lightly. Listen, Williams is not a bad fighter. You know, he, he, he's, he's a decent enough fighter. And uh, you know, but Eubank still looked great against Morrison either. And in his last fight, did he? Let's be fair. If I was going to be with him that night, I'll be. He won't. He won't still a chance. So. Um, you know, but like you say, people advise to occasion with better, better opponents in front of them. But um, I'll, um, I'll definitely, definitely, definitely um, would love that fight with um, the Juventus because I believe I'll be even being confident. Yeah. Talking about those world title fights, Charlo, Triple G, they're, they're the big fights in the division. Where do you feel you, you need to improve and where do you where do you it's feel a, it's, it's, it's not about improving, it's about getting myself in a position and getting the opportunity to, to, yeah. to, to obviously we're always improving in the gym and always always learning in the gym, but you know, it's just about getting getting yourself in the right position. So when when the, when the opportunity comes you, you know, you you can grab a couple of fans and, uh, and, and take them opportunities. Thank you.